Welcome to AEG India Newsroom. Salpone, Connecticut 888 Tablet Quick Specs. Screen size, 7 inches. Display resolution, 1024 by 600 pixels. Display type, TFT touch screen, capacitive. Rear camera, 2 megapixels. Front camera, 0.3 megapixels. OS, Android 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich. Battery, Li-Ion 3500, MH processor, 1.2 GHz CPU. Cellcone Connecticut 888 Tablet Pros. Cellcone Connecticut 888 Tablet is a 7 inches screen size tablet running on 1.2 GHz processor. This tablet runs on Android 4.0 or Ice Cream Sandwich version of operating system. This tablet has been provided with Li Ion battery at 3500 mAh capacity and hence it can provide good amounts of battery life. RAM provided on this mobile is of 512 MB capacity. Although the internal memory provided on this mobile is of just 4 GB, there is provision for the expansion of memory up to 32 GB using Microsoft Dakota card slot. Cellcone Connecticut 888 tablet has got dual cameras as like with many other low-cost tablets. This tablet has got 2 megapixels resolution camera on the rear side and 0.3 megapixels resolution camera on the front side. So this tablet can be used for both video chatting and also for video recording. Cellcone Connecticut 888 Tablet Cons Cellcone Connecticut 888 Tablet has got some cons also. Although Cellcone is a recognizable brand in the market, it is not in par with other top brands and hence it might not get good sales in the market. This tablet comes in smaller screen size and this is the reason why it might not be able to attract those who are looking for bigger screen size tablets. Cellcone Connecticut 888 tablet has been provided with dual cameras, but the quality of both of these cameras is low. Both these rear and front facing cameras can give just basic quality images and basic quality video chatting. Cellcone Connecticut 888 Tablet SIM Card Slot, not available. Price of Cellcone Connecticut 888 Tablet, not available. Overall rating of Cellcone Connecticut 888 Tablet, 3 out of 5. Thanks. Have a nice day. Please subscribe to our channel for latest news.